Hi, and good afternoon. Welcome to the First Spiritualist Church Healing Service. My name is Pastor Reverend Lorena Pyle, and of course, I have our Minister of Healing here with us, Reverend Ann Powell, and she's going to be walking us through a guided meditation as well as giving us a collective consciousness uh, card reading. And that is going to be from the Ascended Masters Oracle Card Deck by Doreen Virtue. So I'm looking forward to that as well. I would like to thank all of you for joining in and joining us. I would like to invite all of the healers to join in to work together in bringing healing to not only those who are here on the camera and reaching out through the internet, but to those who couldn't make it here today to connect with us. I would like to thank the healers that are going to be joining us unseen. Thank you for your healing love and light and energy. So without further ado, let's, um, let's close our eyes and take in a deep breath. We welcome you, wonderful spirit, guides, and angels. Wonderful spirit, all that is. We invite our healing angels, archangels, ascended masters and teachers to bring forth the healing energy, the love, and the light that reaches out with no boundaries, no blockages. To remove ailments, to open eyes and open the knowingness of how to bring resolve and peace and harmony into our own physical bodies and those who seek. If you have a situation, a person, a pet or yourself that seeks or requires extra healing at this time. Hold that energy in your mind's eye or in your heart. Visualize that situation turning out in complete perfection of peace and harmony, joy and happiness. If it is a pet or a person or yourself that you seek this healing request for. Do not focus on the ailment or what you require but focus on the outcome, the complete perfection of who you are or who that person or that pet is. See them completely in their happiest, healed, most wonderful, balanced self. And visualize a beautiful streaming white light coming in from the heavens right in through the top of your head Allow this beautiful healing, light, heavenly energy to move all the way through your body. Let that healing love and light touch the energy or the picture that you have in your mind's eye, in your heart, in your hands. And with the intention of peace, and love, let that flow out to the entire world, into the entire universe. Know that as you allow yourself to be this beautiful, clear vessel of healing, love, light, and energy, you are also touched with this wonderful healing power. deep breath in we thank you wonderful healers Archangel Michael Archangel Raphael brother Jesus mother Mary st. Teresa all of those angels that you have called in to help with your healing and assistance thank them now offer them your highest blessings and your gratitude 
We thank you, wonderful spirit, wonderful God, guides and angels, and so it is. And now, Reverend Ann has our collective message for the day. Balance career and home life, ISIS. Career and home, ISIS. Okay. You drew this card as a reminder to keep balance in your life. You can do this more easily than you may imagine. You already know which part of your life is lopsided, and you may be feeling symptoms of burnout from this imbalance. You can rapidly shift your energy in positive ways by devoting time each day to your priorities. Even 30 minutes a day spent in meaningful ways will lift your mood, morale, and motivation. Additional meaning, meanings for this card. Play is a much needed requirement for you right now. Make sure that your needs are being met. Delegate work to others. Say no to unrealistic demands upon your time. Be honest with yourself and keep healthy boundaries in your work and home life. Spend more time devoted to activities that make your heart sing with joy. Amen. Amen. Well, thank you, Reverend Ann. Sure. Well, that kind of ties into the uh, meditation we're going to do. <laughs> oh, good. <laughs> yeah. So get comfortable and take in a deep breath. Breathe it all the way in and all the way out. Take another deep breath. This time, breathe deep. Breathe in the energy of the center of the earth, the hot lava energy. Breathe this in and bring it all through your body and breathe out. With this next breath, breathe in the energy of the earth all through your body into your crown chakra and breathe out into the universe. branches from the tree of your energy all throughout the universe, through your crown chakra, through your third eye. Imagine yourself a prehistoric oak tree and you are now opening up to the universe. Breathe in this energy from the universe this universal light from heaven. Breathe this in through your crown chakra. And bring this into your heart. And breathe out. See yourself in a campground. It is the evening and it is a new moon. And you can see the stars surround you up above. They're so brilliant. You can see the constellations, Cancer, Gemini, Leo. You can see the North Star. On the ground, there is green grass 
and you are in the meadow of this perfect green grass. It is green and moist, and before you there is a bonfire. It is built of logs that are standing up in the form of a tiki fire. And this is a strong, roaring fire, but it is not too hot. You are perfectly safe around this bonfire. It keeps you safe, and it is your friend, and it is here to protect you. You are camping in this meadow, and you are perfectly safe. You can smell the bonfire smoke, and it is not overwhelming. But you can smell this fragrance of the Palo Santo that is burning in the fire, and it makes you warm. And you can feel the smoke surrounding the campground and the, the grass and the whole area but it is not overwhelming. It is healing you. And it is protecting, protecting you. And it is clearing you of all negative energy. Breathe this in. back on one of the blankets and you look at the stars above you and they are your friends and they're sparkling for you and they let you know that they are there for you all the time your family is there who have already crossed over and your friends and they tell you that they are always here for you the time. You look back at the fire and you breathe in more and you bring in more of this smoke to cleanse your aura and you tell it it is time for you to be going back to earth. And it offers you a message in the smoke as it billows up above the fire. This is a message from heaven. It could be from someone you love or from an angel. The fire tells you gaze into the smoke and look for the message. may come to you later, but you are receiving this message into your heart. You thank the bonfire for everything, for protecting you, for clearing your aura, for healing you, and for being with you that this evening. And you thank the bonfire for the messages. And you look up at the sky and you say thank you to your family and all of the angels and the heavenly beings for being with you. And we're so grateful. And you lay back down on the blanket. And now it is time for you to come back. You wrap yourself up in the blanket as you're getting tired. And now we will count to five and you will be back in your body. One, two, three, 
four, five. Stretch your arms, your feet, wiggle your toes, and lower back. Namaste. Thank you, Reverend Ann. Thank you. I just want to remind everyone to um, like, share, and subscribe. Check out our website to be able to find more archive videos or to find out what's new and happening. So um, the church is open now, but we have guidelines. When you come, you will have your temperature taken, and if it's above normal, then um, you won't be able to come into the church, but you'll still be able to find us on social media. So I believe we're on YouTube and uh, Instagram, uh, Facebook, and we're still practicing social distancing and hand washing, of course, all the time. And right. we have our masks here. And uh, of course, when you come into the church, we have uh, markings set down and ushers that will hand sanitize you and you have somewhere to come and sit. So if you're concerned about being around other people that might be infected, you know, you'll be safe here because we're practicing our, our safety requirements and sanitizing everything afterwards, but um, this is the time that we live in right now, and we're very fortunate that we can reach out through social media and connect with all of you. So I would like to say thank you very much for tuning in, and um, oh, we also have a donate button on our website, and those donations help keep the church open and running so that when we are all able to come back here we have this wonderful building to come back to and hopefully we'll be able to start having the wonderful meals and so, yeah. the healing services and classes and all of those things that that make us all happy and aligned and yep. joyful that's right would you like to say anything to end the service um yes uh, our, we have a new web page that has been posted and it's working now so please take a look over and uh, like and subscribe <laughs> we're so grateful and um, so we thank the angels for being with us and uh, all of our healers who have tuned in all of those needing healing and all of those who like to provide healing both the um, healers from our church or around the world and um, we're just so very grateful for everybody. Thank you so much. Thank you. Shall we end this with a wonderful heart explosion? That's right. So love to all. We love you so much. And until we meet again, take time to be friendly. And... <laughs>